What's the new game this? Barrow Hill, Curse of the Ancient Circle. Oh my god. Volvo or college videos. But from where I'm sitting, it looks like it will pass us by. <laughs> Should I hide my cursor? Wow, this is a choice. I like it. Shoot your own black and white intro. Oh, the greeniness. Oh, it's great. Oh, YouTube compression's gonna love this. What happened? Oh, I need to change our thing. There we go. I updated. Oh boy. I want to look at my car. I love how many scary games start with you just getting out of your car and leaving the headlights on. Like, why? Why would you do this? Can I... I can't do nothing with these mushrooms. What? I can't go back. Because you don't have a flashlight? I, I guess that's the idea, but... But you run down your battery if you're gonna, like, leave and go into the darkness anyway. I understand if you leave the engine running. But you, most of these games, you don't do that. So, it's dark. Oh, okay. What? Can I go over here? What is that over Oh no, I was not prepared f for the point and click. I was not prepared. Where am I? Did I go back to the road? What's happening? I'm just gonna stumble my way through here. It's a gas station, that's good. Oh, and a cafe. Petrol Snacks Motel. Barrow Hill service station. H Hello? Omega 3 regeneration hair tonic. Okay. Sure. Um. Oh, spooky noise. Spooky noise just happened. Most ancient live. Most ancient live? I'm not sure what that's supposed to say. There's a really cool documentary on Shudder about folk horror and they cover a lot of British stuff. I know about this documentary. I've been trying to... I, I need to get the energy to sit through the whole thing. Alright. Can I check out this... Barrow Hill Circle by Class 3D. Cute. Oh, I guess this is going to be my inventory. Oh, from left to right, Barrow Hill Stone Circle, Beligo, Melka, Dolment, Hammerstone, Henrik, Gavrock. I sh don't know how to say that properly. Ky Kylie? Kylie's? I don't know my Gaelic pronunciation, I'm afraid. Uh, 
Okay, Barrow Hill Circle. There are two stone circles here at Barrow Hill. A large circle surrounds the base of the hill, and a smaller circle crowns the top, where the ancient barrow can be found. Barrows are burial mounds. These mounds have sometimes been added to much earlier existing ritual sites and have become round barrow, the round barrows of today. Later, cremated burials may have been placed within beakers or pots and added to existing barrows. Burials may have been... Welcome to history class. <sighs> It really should have been cut up into a six-part series because it's structured as if that were the plan and there were so many places to stop. This already reminds me of the ending of Psychomania slash Death Wheelers. Oh, God. The purpose of these... Oh, whoops. Uh, burials may have been at intervals of several hundred years, spreading from the Bronze Age to the Iron Age and into Roman times. And there's versions of this all over the world, really. Um, not everywhere, but in other places besides you know the uk um the purpose we're in cornwall in this game i think is what it said the purpose of the stone circles and rows is unclear but is generally accepted as ceremonial stone rows and alignments may form avenues researchers suggest that circles are aligned astronomically or with other ancient sites and natural features the stone circles at barrow hill are thought to have existed since 2500 bc Okay. Oh God. I'm not gonna read all this. It's about megalithic Cornish sites, chambered tombs, Neolithic, Bronze Age. Okay, bye. I'll come back when I've got a puzzle. <laughs> Harvest festival, cute. Do not eat the exhibit. The bread and eggs are at least two weeks old. Okay. H Hello. Anybody here? Autumn sale. Barrow Hill jigsaw puzzle. Cute. Oh! We're literally going to do a puzzle. I can do this. This is an easy one. We got it. We got this. Well, and it, and it goes away. Watch somebody's... Hello? Hello? It was really quiet. stupid lantern anyway you might need it if you're out there with that thing you'll be able to get about easier if you can get it working can't you hear it searching what was it they told me don't work How's up that? here my mom so she said it was a bad place to stay away why didn't i listen those stupid old stories and the freaks that tell them maybe they were right stay away Stay away from the barrow. Good, good. <laughs> Sorry, I realized Who's I didn't. There? Where did you come from? <laughs> I can see you out there. The kings of the past have been disturbed. Who's out the there? kings of the past have been disturbed. <laughs> that sounds like an M.R. James reference. I like how he he has this whole conversation with me, and then is and then goes back to being like, "Who are you? Who's that out there? Oh my god, somebody's out there!" <laughs> like, we just spoke, sir. What was meant to be honored, remembered, has fallen into ignorance. Okay, good talk. 
Good talk. Good, good, good talk. The balls? <laughs> I just instinctively started clicking. Okay, maybe we'll need some brown sauce. It's a always cool story for Hokia. Okay. Can I... Barrow Hill service station menu. Look at the scampi and fish and chips and I keep forgetting I have clips in my hair so I keep messing with what? What is that noise? All right, this place is like they got quite the um I can't take a bake, it's good. Is that tambourine supposed to be frightening? Oh, this is great. I'm super- I'm, I'm into this. This is great. Oh, look. More baked goods. Well, eat it! <laughs> if you're gonna mess with it. If you're gonna put your hands all over it. Mushy peas. Yum. Are you drinking the sauce? I don't know. I don't know what I was doing. I think I was just like putting my hand in it repeatedly like a kid playing with their mashed potatoes. This is really gross. To all staff, please note that fake 10 pound notes are circulating in this area. Any notes accepted will- any notes accepted that presumably are bad will be deducted from your pay. That's shitty. <sighs> Stuff to look out for. Well, you know, honestly, by 2006, I think we had the little black light things, but maybe not. Maybe that wasn't until a little later. If it was ketchup, I can relate. <laughs> oh, we are. Got a little schedule. School disco with K's instead of C's. Hardcore trance. Five days! DJ's doormat. Nice. Boxy, aka Lady Adastra. Ooh, I bet she's hardcore. Maggie. Okay, Ben. Maggie has phoned in sick today, and Carol's still on holiday. I shall be here during the day, working in the office while it's quiet. Uh, gee. So I guess that's George is in the office. Uh, I can cover your role on the pumps if you can work in the kitchen. The washing up can wait till tomorrow if you're too busy. Mr. Morris has also requested that you keep the volume down on that radio. I know the evening shift can be boring, but try to keep the noise down a little bit as the poor guy is trying to sleep. Please have a tidy up. Please have a tidy up and vacuum this evening. Are you going to like make me do the chores? Babs cabs. <laughs> Anytime, anywhere. I, f I feel like... Oh, okay, so I'm going to be able to get in here at some point because it's got a little thingamabobber. Hello? Nope. Ooh, cryptic crossword. The, they only managed to do mint and go. <laughs> wow. Okay. Stop putting your hands all over smoking kills. If you're mysteriously stuck here, you may as well rob the place. I mean... There's the ketchup. Energy! Ooh, Ben, thank you for the flowers you left me. They were a lovely surprise. You know how much work I have been putting into my night course. With the exam over, I look forward to finding out how I've scored. Wish me luck. I was wondering if you'd like to go out and celebrate, or not, as the case may be, when I get the results. I'm sure George will let you have the night off. M, which I guess is Maggie. I should probably be speaking like this every time I open something, eh? Oh, I can't knock again. Must have been real. I must have been dreaming. It's like living in a nightmare. Not Oh, I, I didn't notice this over here. I think Cornwall, they're a little pirate sounding. 
what happened? Oh, did I get a crayon? I got a crayon! It's my first item. I got a crayon. Oh no. Somebody was coloring cows and stuff. Your accents are always so good. Uh, blah, 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 blah. They could be better, but thank you. I'm out of practice. Wow, it's a Mercedes. Jeez. Um. Okay. Oh, that looks creepy. Stop. Friend, foe, feeding seagulls harms them and us. All right. Hello. No, I didn't want to turn it off. <laughs> I just wanted to leave it on. Hello? Yes! Matches! I have matches and I have a wax crayon. I don't know what I need either of them. Are we sitting on the toilet? It sounded like somebody was coming in. Marley, that sign reminds me of that time we got attacked by an eagle on the beach for your burger. Yeah, I always tell that story. At least you didn't have to reach into the toilet. <laughs> this seems accurate to the average visitor. <laughs> Hi, how you doing? <laughs> Okay, there are footsteps. Creepy. Ah. Uh, okay. Wait, were you sitting in the urinal? I. So if I do this, I just make myself comfortable. And then I listen to creepy footsteps happening around me. That weird water is definitely coming from the urinal, right? Noise. Uh, I like how I've touched so many things and so little has actually happened. The sink is, dri is dripping also. Yeah. You're right. I am vaguely unsettled. So, you know. Can I go into the ladies? I can! Okay, we got more seagull. Creepy. Oh, it won't let me go all the way in. All I can do is peek. All I can do is be a voyeur. Okay. Yeah, let me, can I check out this car? Yes, I need somebody's keys. This is the other problem, is that I'm putting current day weird indie horror logic on this game, which is probably incorrect. I need to be thinking of this as just like a puzzle adventure game. From the early aughts. I keep being able to approach things that I'm confused about being able to approach. Can you look in the open door of the other car? I was trying, but it won't let me move forward. It only lets me look here. And it's, yeah, I'm, 
Oh! Here's something I definitely missed. What is this? Cornish Fungi Kingdom. Alright, of course it's by somebody named Ellen Hating. Oh, okay, I picked it up. Oh, 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 fungus guide. There was that fungus I, I wasn't allowed to interact with earlier. I wonder if I'm going to have to, um... Can I... Let me try... No, it won't let me go around the car that direction. It'll let me go this way, though. Are you, like... What is that flashlight ne next to the pump? I don't know. Monolith. Okay. Wait. Was I like climbing through? I was climbing through that. Why would I do that? Yeah, what is this giant thing? Nope. That brings me here. How about if I go forward? Oh wait, there's some like flowers or something. Wait, wait. Wow, there's no backup button. You have to like consistently turn around. Yep. Nope, I'm just not allowed to look at that. Okay, here we go. Uh... Why can I only look in this one? It's a definitely empty. Oh, it will be me next. Yeah, it's gonna be you next. Definitely not me. I'm the protagonist. Um, I have a wax crayon. Can I... Am I supposed to, like, do the crossword puzzle? Oh! I, I saw this and then I missed it. Arthurian legends. King Arthur. Da 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 da. One version is a legend that suggests that Arthur was a Cornishman and that Cornwall was his kingdom. Have I heard that version? The castle of Tintagil. Tintagil is now associated with Arthur. It's true past forgotten. We can say for certain that the term Arthur has become a collective name, absorbing stories of a hero of a hero of ancient people and the rulers, forgotten kings and great warriors. Uh, history suggests there were not many people here in prehistoric Cornwall in the early Stone Age. These forgotten folk. That tambourine needs to stop. <laughs> These forgotten folk grew over the centuries with the migration in Europe, Ireland, and Wales, and the rest of the UK. Cornwall became divided into smaller kingdoms, each with their own rulers, deities, faith, and folk tales. Invaders showed up. Romans, blah, 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 blah. Cornwall remained an outpost of ancient times, retaining much of its forgotten past. You can get a glimpse at our forgotten kings and deities by looking at sites such as Lanyon Quat. <laughs> Quit. Found between Penzance and the Land's End. Modern myth tells us that King Arthur used the stone top as a dining table before his last battle. The Arthurian legend essentially desecrates this well-preserved burial chamber of one of our real ancient kings. George is jamming in the office. <laughs> Spooky tambourine. <laughs> Can I... Nope. Nope. Um, um, cool. It's his emotional support tambourine. Yeah, that's why we don't hear him muttering when we're when we're walking around over here. Okay. I have a wax crayon and some matches. I am I going to be melting the wax crayon to do something? That would be my guess. Sticky brown sauce. <laughs> um. <laughs> Why? Why? What's gonna happen? What? Get away from me! What do you think you're doing? In the darkness, after the power surge, I couldn't light that stupid lantern. The lantern, I didn't have any right. matches left I have dry. matches now. You'll be able to get about easier if you can find some. Can't you hear it? Why didn't I listen? All those stories, all those people who have disappeared. Maybe they were true. He talks like this. Stay away. Stay away from the barrow. He's very excited. 
Um, Where did you come from? <laughs> I can see you out there. He's talking about a lantern, but I don't think I've actually oh, seen the lantern, have I? Oh yeah, you guys get to come along with me as I get very lost in a puzzle adventure game. Oh hey, there's a post box. What's this? Dear Marianne, I hope you are well and the clothes shop is busy, busy, busy. I will be needing a new nighty suit for the chilly winter nights. The autumn equinox has really sneak sneaked up, sneaked up, sneaked up on me this year. Thank goodness for Saint Annika. Oh, of all the cheek. Have you seen the stamp on this card? It's one of those hideous communication masts for mobile phone signals. It's rather ironic, given that Barrow Hill has one such monstrosity hidden away behind the service station. I wish that thing would get rusty and fall down. Chat again soon. Yours, Elsie. Okay. So there's a comm tower thing somewhere nearby. Hello, mouse. They won't know where I am. The sky. Why? Why? What's gonna happen? Pagan and wicked magic. Oh my gosh, the fairy cover. Oh my goodness. Fairies and sprites. Air moves us, fire transforms us, water shapes us, earth heals us. Okay. So yeah, we, we got some Wiccans up in here. Magical crystals, seasons and celebrations, Yules, Imbolc, Astara. Is it Astara or Ostara? S you don't mention Salin. Okay. <laughs> Myths and legends of Barrow Hill. Okay, here's some interesting stuff. Long time ago, in an age before our forefathers, the ancient rulers of this land placed upon Barrow Hill the sum of all their magics. For millennia beforehand, the people had fought off the approaching armies of darkness. Dude being like, they don't know I'm in here. Oh, why they won't know where I am. Loudly to himself. And he won't stop. For millennia beforehand, the people had fought off the approaching armies of darkness who dwelt in the dark and stagnant places uh, like an infestation of evil. These creatures of the netherworld had escaped their lower level of existence with help from Mogred, who now rules them from a twisted labyrinth of Fogos caves beneath the hill. Lol, well, it's like when I used to play hide and seek with my little sister and I could hear her saying, Thou look behind the dresser! <laughs> Margaret had turned to the dark arts and started following the path of the darkest necromancy. His mind and body had deformed with the dark powers until his very soul was possessed with wickedness and festering evil. The ruling kings banded together and marched upon Barrow Hill, which held the entrance to Mogred's lair. There they began their chants and placed upon the earth a spell that would entomb Margaret and his netherworld minions. To guard the prison, the kings themselves became tall standing rocks and circled about the seal. They have guarded it for centuries to ensure it would never be opened again. Let me guess, it's been opened. The fall of Balin, the ruler of Cornovia, had traveled to Ireland in order to make a bond between the lands of the Celtic faith. There, he met with King Fallow, and they began to build their alliance. All was well until one eve, Balin's eyes fell upon Fallow's daughter. Oh, crap. She was a girl of beauty, and Balin could not help but follow her siren-like charm to a tower chamber. There, she beckoned him to enter through a doorway. Balin was transfixed by her magic as the door closed behind him, and his mind was lost to the fair lady. Suddenly, the tower door burst open, and there stood Fallow, sword in hand. With one swipe, he smote off Balin's head. Fallow looked around for the girl who faded with a mischievous giggle, for it was not really Fallow's daughter, as she had passed away years before. It was, in fact, an imp in disguise, <laughs> who had ensnared Balin's mind as it had his daughter. Balin's head was taken back to Cornwall by his men and placed upon a stone atop a hill, because that's normal. There it began to speak, and instructed them to build a shrine around it. The head would wait until the ancient kingdom of Cornovia was at its greatest peril. At that time, he would awake, and his ethereal body would rise from the earth to defend his kingdom. 
All right. Oh, God. There's even more. All right. Teeth of the demon. The earth was still new, its plane of existence green and lush. The most spectacular of the lands was that of Cornwall, of course. Sprites flicked between the trees and plants, tending to them as they went. Their song sang out beautifully, and it echoed about the lands as far as the Isle of Leones, where the evil demon of molten rock and fire who had looked upon the lands with contempt and disgust. That's where he lived. I think I missed a couple words because I was trying to do it fast. He had existed long before the land of Cornwall and was jealous of the sprites. Damn those fairies. Uh, um, their song of beauty had driven him to despair. Each note burnt his twisted body. He sent out. He set out one day to take revenge. How dare you be happy? He burrowed into the ground and began to tunnel from the island towards the mainland. As he clawed the earth in front of him, he threw the rock back out of his tunnel. It fell from the isle into the sea and caused a huge wave. The demon continued to re rip open the earth. The spines on his ba back sliced a groove in the roof of his tunnel like a massive crack. Finally, the demon reached Cornwall. With a huge roar, he frantically clawed his way out of the ground. This dude. <laughs> Bruh. Too much. His fiery skin tore open the rock and he pushed his open mouth forth to bellow fire into the sky and turn the forest to ash. So a volcano, because it used to actually be volcanic over there. He broke the surface at the same time that the wave he had created washed over the Isle of Lannies and it sank beneath the sea. The strength of his roar caused the tunnel roof to crack open and the cold sea water surged up into the tunnel. Reaching the demon, it doused him and smothered his fiery body. So he was his own oh, worst enemy here he killed himself um he turned to stone as his mouth burst through the forest floor today his body lays in slumber beneath barrow hill the earth is still pierced by the teeth from his gaping mouth and the spines on his back show through the surface if you stand in the circle of teeth you can hear the echoes of his dying roar okay so basically three different versions of why these rocks like exist dial dial stupid thing why won't anyone answer why can't I phone outside? Why am I here? I presume because you were... They won't know where I am. I got... I, I, I got it. Go! Will anybody ever find me? Excuse me! I didn't look at this busted chair. Um... There's nothing here. We're cheating. I don't care. It's somewhere. It's somewhere. I think it said in the kitchen. place has such a menu. I thought I clicked on that before. Yeah, that looks that looks like a lantern. Do I So how do I select the matches? Um, uh, hello? Oh, there we go. I'm smart. <laughs> I, I can see. Cool. And do I just... Is there... I guess the light is just on all the time until it kills me, huh? This place looked super abandoned. Well, I guess we can go... 
wonder if I should go back to my car and check out that fungi. <laughs> Maybe I should run. Maybe you should run. I'm gonna bother him again. Victory, that's right. Who's that? Oh, it's you. I've been watching you on the CCTV camera. Walking about. Don't you know what's out there? No, I, I don't. It. The voices in my head, they echo on and on. Oh and boy. On. Timeless, fearless, faceless. He's heavy with sleep after feeding. It'll wake soon. It'll come for you. It's tracking you, following your scent and mine. I hope you're next. Then maybe it'll leave me alone. The shadow moves. Even with that lamp, you'll not get far. It's only a matter of time before it finds you, hunts you down. If I can hide long enough, someone's bound to come. Oh, maybe I can get away. This guy. And why shouldn't I? Why? Why? What maybe it was you all along. I? Murderer. Murderer. They were just arriving. They'd just driven in and it caught them. Murderer. Them. Cut them down as they ran. It happened in seconds. It couldn't have been real. I must have been dreaming. Get away from me. The ancient queen. They've been awoken. Dial. Okay. Well, I've had enough of that guy, so... I kind of want to go back and see what the mushroom is, but I don't know how to get back. So... Hello? Hey! Let's check out the telephone. That's pretty creepy. All right. Good talk. D can I go this way? I can. Okay. Oh, danger. What the? What kind of scarecrow thing is this? That's creepy. There's a motorcycle. A motorcycle. Is there... Can I... Yeah, I'd like to look at the motorcycle. Thank you. No. H Hello? Man, I can look at a lot of stuff I can't do anything with. Eh. 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 Okay. Can I... Man, that cello is trying to make me unsettled. Uh-oh, what happened here? Bad thing happened. Oh no. Barrow Excavation. Cornovia Weekly. Conrad Morse. Noted archaeologist, professor and gentleman has surprised archaeology circles after gaining permission to dig Barrow Hill. Following permission from the English Archaeological Committee. I can't do it this, this slow. He will investigate the little known and untouched enigma, which is Barrow Hill. The site has, until now, been left alone and undisturbed. The monument is not recorded on maps or surveys, and the area has never been touched throughout the centuries it has stood. Barrow Hill, as a site, has baffled some superficial studies. Shrouded in myth and legend, it stands on and around a natural wooded hill. Some stories claim that the monument is a man is a man-made representation of the ancient Cornish kings. Controversy incited locals during the mid-1960s when the 
uh, construction of the service station went ahead near the Barrow site. With locals avoiding the area, it went unnoticed until completion. Mystery still surrounds the disappearance of the construction workers. Okay. But the attention promoted visitors to the area. The stories have since become part of local for folklore. Folklore. And the area only raised its head from myth and legend when the telecommunications mobile mast was installed near the uh, near behind near behind service station. <laughs> to add to the local mystery and unease, the workers of 2001 disappeared from the very site. The police have yet to discover their whereabouts. The existing archaeological information available on Barrow Hill is due to the work of the missing Professor Amelia Rumford. Notes, sketches, surveys, and studies were found abandoned in her satchel bag at the site. This further missing person only added to the folklore of demons in danger at the ancient site. Yeah, that sounds kind of messed up. Barrow Hill Radio. For the fabulous sounds. Your local radio station from the top of the world. Ooh, it's a photo book of old Cornish sites. If the devs aren't from Cornwall, I'll be very disappointed. And somebody's kid at the end. Hey, hey, hey. I wasn't done looking. It's coming for me. I hear the sentry crashing through the undergrowth. It knows where I am. It knows I tried to flee. Yet I am trapped here. There is little time left for me. Why do you not listen more closely to the whispers? Were they a warning or an instruction? Or the voices of ghosts? Were they the voices of ghosts of the past? I thought I was beginning to understand the ancient monument, yet now I know I was just stumbling about in darkness. If only I'd known what we were about that we were about to disturb when we opened the barrow, when I disturbed the barrow. He's been waiting for so long, waiting to be awoken once more. He's under approaches. My time is almost over. <sighs> oh, that's just mine now. This PDA is just mine now. Bluetooth connection, huh? We got some CCTV of our own and a survey map. Notes. Remote Four remote cameras. My dreams are filled with images, yet when I awake... I guess I should be doing the voice, huh? Yet when I awake, confusion descends upon me and the clarity is gone. The whispers on the wind, I follow their instruction. Nobody else knows what I've done, what I've set free. What was I thinking? I know now what I've released. There's so much I have to explain. I'm staying in room three at the service station motel. I must not forget my motel door code. 793. Just write that down real quick. Let me just... I ain't gonna remember. I know my brain. Nope. Okay. Don't don't take the note or anything. Okay. Um, I guess we should go back then. Before we continue this way. And see if we can get more... Um, room three, huh? Aha! The one I was trying to get into. Can I... How do I get up there? How do I... What? No, no, no. I'm... I have a thing I'm trying to do right now. How do I get... You gave me your code, and I can't find a way <laughs> up into the motel. Nothing annoys me more than that kind of thing. 793. No! Six. Seven. Did I say 793 and I meant 796? Hang on. Yeah, it's 796, right? That's what I wrote down. <laughs> it's not what I said, though. Okay. All right. Yeah. Stupid. 
Stop the fear. Stop me. What is this in the toilet? What was... You said we weren't going to have to fish in the toilet? We're fishing in the toilet. Oh my, yep. I just fished in the toilet. Um... I don't know if this is the same voice, but I guess it, it will be. It must be. He sees us as vermin, a disease now eating away creation, his country. Like a plague, we rip the goodness from the earth and play, replace it only. Why can I? Of course, the night I really can't talk is the night we have a text every game. And replace it with only the excrement of our existence. <laughs> September 15th. Why must I suffer these fools? Why must they hunger beneath? That's a capital H on that he. Archaeology is not about destruction. The idiots who call themselves protesters are damaging what we seek to understand. The science and knowledge we uncover is vital for the future. As the child of an archaeologist, I understand and sympathize with both ends of this. If there's protests, though... You probably shouldn't be digging there. The science and knowledge we uncover is vital for the future. To understand and appreciate is a gift these vandals lack. They're not vandals. Sitting around and being like, don't dig here is not vandalism. <laughs> the newfound expressions of self-invented worth. Now they're actually damaging equipment and shit. Okay. The sentry's god is resting place, honored over time to please him. I don't, I don't. <laughs> Yet forgotten now they stand alone, decaying, forgotten and clouded in myth with no purpose. An age has passed since they judged the offerings. I will honor him. What am I saying? I am a man of science. Yet to understand, one must explore the possibilities? Question mark. Myth and legend often stem from a truth. True tales told over time to become a fab to become the fables with an apostrophe. We here today. Anyway, <laughs> now there's more. Now we're fishing in the. <sighs> now we're fishing in the shower. Oh God, it is. It is not. <sighs> Uh, September 10th. Why don't we listen? I'm, I'm doing this normal voice. Why don't we listen? The message was left embedded in our very souls. He was one of many, and those like him feel the pain we inflict. Taking what was once good and pure and miraculous, we abuse it and the trust he granted us. The soil is rich with energy. The lines are clear to me. The seal is cracking, the future open. I see... <gasps> what am I saying? In fever, I write drivel that makes no sense. If it were not my handwriting and my own hand which holds the pen, I would never believe it. September 11th. He lays waiting, watching us in the forgotten cage that has become his prison. His temple was forgotten. Soon he will send forth his hounds and begin the hunt again. September 12th. The geophysical survey has arrived. It is a fabulous development in the archaeological toolkit to be able to create an image through the ground beneath our feet by compositing all the data taken by magnetic and radio probing of the very earth we are to excavate. The imagery will take some time to interpret, but I have no doubt that secrets lay hidden amongst the digital mess. What lies beneath the barrow still remains to be discovered. I mean, that would be... that's... We mostly use that to find burials, but other stuff too, I guess. Wow. Here's a little timeline for us. Dark Ages, the Celtic Iron Age, Bronze Age, Neolithic, New Stone Age, Mesolithic, Midstone Age. Oh boy. GPS system, remote cameras. Yep. Okay, we got some nice shirts here. Creepy, creepy art. Can't make sense out of much. Mouse tarot. Ancient something. Ancient kings. Something watches his slumber. That one again. Looks like a green man or something. Claws. I'm gonna go with tonsils. A weird egg owl thing. 
Um, this is kind of like a labyrinth. Look at what we've done. Something, something, something darkness. He watches. The ancients are awakes. Are awakes. <laughs> Set him free. Ba ba ba. Green man or tree beard. Yeah. Brain barrow. Um, okay. Bala wall barrow. All right. Karn uni beehive hut. Uh. Oh wow. Um. There's another note here. I want it. Can I grab it? No, I'm not allowed. He's messing with something in here. No, no, no. I didn't mean to... Samples. Dirt samples, I guess? Hey, I wanted to look at the... I wanted to look at the labyrinths over here. Ooh. We need a briefcase code. Definitely have not encountered one yet. Hi, there's more here. Somebody had fun drawing all that. Quacksy quack quacksies. What kind of kind of toothpaste is that? Okay. I keep waiting for a jump scare in one of these mirrors, honestly. Okay. Can I... Nope. Okay. Um... Notes. Just the hotel note? No note about... Well, I like how there's like no back button on this thing. Oh, there it is. I like how there's no back button. Back to menu, darling. Back to menu. Okay. I don't see anything there just yet, but okay. Hmm. I'm wondering about this code. I was thinking it would give me something coming back here, but it didn't. So let's keep going down the creepy path. Of course I want the lantern. Alright, this is- yeah, okay. We're almost to where we found the information. <laughs> oh, there's a path here. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I was wondering. We can't- oh, we- Another impassable, you may not leave spot. Oh, wait, 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 wait. They crashed into it. Can I have this? Oh, oh, it was, um, it's, it's literally on the ground. Hang on. I'm not allowed to take it with me. Okay, hang on. 15.3, 15. something. Stop it. Nope. Nope. There we go. Fifteen. And this is Emma Harry, back on the air again after that power cut. I'll be your nightlight till around about one o'clock, so long as we don't have any more power ups. I braved outside to fire up the generator and I'm up and running under my own steam. High tonight at the BHR station. Alone here on Barrow Hill. Though I could swear I saw someone up here with me a moment ago. With a little bit less daylight this time of year, you can imagine anything in that ever-increasing darkness. Why not give me a call and say hello on 585? And in case you've forgotten, it's the autumn equinox, the beginning of autumn. Or for those from across the pond, the beginning of fall. And while the daylight hours are dwindling, there's a harvest festival celebration tomorrow down by the harbour. But if you're so excited you can't sleep, well, stay up with me and I'll figure out some way to keep you occupied. 
<laughs> oh yeah, I, I'm into this. Oh, sorry. I was getting, we got so excited about the introduction of the trumpet. Sorry, I can't help myself. I actually really like this. I'm a sucker for like bad music like this. She has a great voice for late night radio. <laughs> She's doing her best, ain't she? Face, dude. Yeah, yeah no, I'm having a good time. If you keep everyone informed, fortunately, this phase won't last too long, and you can soon start to plan your long term future without having to watch for the knives in your bag. Aquarius, most of the planets are Do they actually have one for like all of them, of your or is she gonna cut to a break? I got a happy my cat making my legs fall asleep here. Until later in the month when you'll be in a better position to spot your best way forward. This is oh no. Ew. That sounds pretty. Your future. Health and vitality remain good this week. This is amazing. Let's just chill here for a while. I gotta stretch my leg out, cat. Well, as it gives you a chance to be noticed by those who can help. Noticed, oh, noticed. Twenty-four hour horoscopes. horoscopes. Capricorn. No one can accuse you of not trying this week. As you seem to be busier than ever. Both Don't mind me. We're just uh, I'm, here. I'm gonna take a drink. Everybody, ha hydrate. Have a snack. Run to the bathroom. To question whether this whirlwind lifestyle is what you desire in the long term. Libra. They really do have one for everybody. By sticking to your guns, accept the respect you have managed to retain recently. Oh, I'm sorry. I keep hitting the mic tonight. But you've laid a strong foundation on which to build. What will your stars reveal about you? You're listening to your future guide. 24 hour horoscopes on 1224. 1224? For your latest guide to possible love, romance, wealth, and health. You're listening I to could, Astro Can I get paid to be this person? To just like record a thing every day or every week. I'm just okay. Okay, it it picks. It only has certain ones. Oh, I didn't mean to turn it off. Oh, I'm trying to find creepy stuff. I wonder if this is door mat with two T's. We're gonna wait. We're gonna see if a beat if the beat really drops here. Oh, um, the mic is uh, SE Dynacaster. I can't remember. It's something electronics Dynacaster. Um, it's a dynamic mic. I I splurged on it. It's not a cheap mic, for sure. Not the most expensive mic, but I definitely splurged. Okay, moving on here. Hey Bob, you're looking good these days. My hair's starting to thin. First 
XLR. It's an XLR I have plugged into uh, an interface that creates a USB signal into the computer. Audient Evo 4. Yeah. I've used USB, I've used condenser. This is my this is my um I this is my first dynamic mic and it's the first time that I feel like I actually sound like myself when I talk into it. I'll take my breaths out. Antiques Adventure Land. That actually sounds really cool. I'd go there. Have you tried the latest in dental care products? Why not pick up a tube of ginger toothpaste? It's guaranteed to freshen your breath, fight plum, and tooth decay like no other leading brand. And whilst doing all that, it whitens your yellowing teeth, unlike other market products available. Try ginger toothpaste. When did this come out? This ca this game came out in 2006. May contain nuts? There's too much. Okay, we're moving on. You want to know what this music is? The Weather Channel. Yeah, it looked dated. Never heard of this. Yeah, I I stumbled upon it when going through a list of like recommended abandonware titles. Like it did get a re, -re they did put it out on they did like re-release it onto Steam, but I don't really think it's had much. I don't think it's had anything done to it since. Wait, wait, wait. More tunes straight up from BHR. They hate her. Join Tiny Cow down at the self service carrot farm. Pick your favorite fruit vegetables fresh from the earth whilst Tarly entertains you. Follow the day glow direction signs from Sinopo. Entertainment while you pick root vegetables. <laughs> Sounds like Japan. Seventeen eleven don't got nothing. Alright, that's that's all she wrote on the on the on the radio. 